everybody, welcome back to the more YouTube channel. It's Chris back with another rant stroke thought of the day. This one is a bit of a rant, to be honest with you. So the news has broke that the Premier League has announced its nominations for the team of the season. And a massive congratulations in this to four of our lads who have made it onto the nominee shortlist. You've got Kieran Trippier, Sven Botman, Bruno and Miggy have all made it onto the nominations list, which is absolutely amazing. I would be shocked if at least... Not two or three of the lads end up in the team this season because we've been unbelievable this season, especially at the back. Uh, I think there's a few people can be considered hard done by in our team, but one in particular, which I'm going to get stuck right into here, is where the fuck is Joe Linton in this list? I've just been looking through it. Now, maybe someone in the Premier League can't figure out where Joe Linton plays because he's equally brilliant in midfield as he is in the front three. But some of the people who have got ahead of Joe Linton is unbelievable. I mean, for starters... No fucking Chelsea player should be anywhere near these nominations. I've seen Silver at the back and Kai Havertz is up front. What the fuck? He's been honking all season. I mean, Callum Wilson and Alexander Rizak can feel hard done by. They're not in this list. Next to Kai Havertz, has been dreadful this season. Chelsea have stunk out the Premier League in terms of where they should be as an elite side. So I'm stunned that they're even in this nomination list. But going to midfield where I think Joe Linton is... You know, you've got three Brighton players in there. Yes, you know, you can say they deserve to be in there, some of them. Um, you know, McAllister, certainly. Um, and uh, maybe Sonny Marsh, I suppose. But, you know, three Brighton players in there, really? I mean, over Joe Linton, I just I don't agree with that either. Um, and you've got two Spurs players in there. You've got Bentecourt and Hoiberg. I mean, they haven't been great either this season. Hoiberg in particular. Bentecourt has been brilliant for Spurs, even though Spurs have been crap. And when he got injured, you could see how much of a miss he was. But Hoiberg? Hoiberg over Joe Linton? I don't understand who's doing this. Joe Linton's got eight goals and 36 Premier League or 36 appearances this season in total. He's got two assists. He's been phenomenal. Even Michael Owen, the serial shithouse, said he's one of the best players in the Premier League. So why is he not in this nomination list? It's pretty stupid and shit, really. I don't understand who's doing this list. What are you getting it from? What stats are you looking at? Just look at the lad play. He's unbelievable, man. He's got to be really hard done by Joe Linton not to be in this nominations list. It's Brazil all over again, Joe. It's disgusting. And I'm pissed off with it. So someone in the Premier League should come out and explain why Joe Linton isn't in this nominations list. We're going to get stuck right into this this week um, over the two podcasts. Look at the statistics and how Joe Linton compares to some of those other people who have been putting there ahead of him and see whether we're right to see he can feel justified to be a little bit robbed. Um, but again, it just shows you that eliteness, you know, in terms of the that top four greedy six mentality of, of people still getting nominated. How the fuck are Chelsea players anywhere near this thing? You know, I'd love for somebody to come out and explain that. I really would. Chelsea are sitting in, what, the 11th in the league? You know, Brighton, yeah, I totally understand that. Brighton are in six or something like that, or seventh. Had a phenomenal season. The lads have played really, really well. But Chelsea players, what the hell? You know, um, Silver and, 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 and Havertz I mean Jesus H Christ I have a word you know so yeah I feel sorry for you Joe that's bullshit I think you should be in there again huge credit and respect to the four lads that are in there for us if we don't have at least two or three players in that team of the season I will be back on here with another rant you can take that to the bank I guarantee you this is Chris uh, all done with today's rant of the day if you like this kind of thing smash subscribe come and join us loads of room for you more. I've had loads of new subscribers recently we're on 3,120 I think which is incredible so keep hitting that button come and join us two weekly shows Mondays and Wednesdays and pop-up rants and thoughts of the days just like this. And if you like the video as well, it really helps get it on YouTube. So until then, keep supporting that team of Coy United. We've got a huge game against Southampton today, which hopefully will batter them. I hope Joe Litton stars again. And then we can say, why is he not on this nomination list? Have a word with yourself. We'll catch you later, everybody. Cheers.